थोड़ा शिफ्ट कर लेना तो होल्ड हो success not only for themselves but their for family the community and the country and i always say those who have a vision are many they benefit india more than those who don't have it so it's good to have a vision and with the vision you drive yourself and the inspiration you get is through your vision so i think it's a very good that you celebrate success not many people celebrate success these days we celebrate success in churches other people to emulate those who have already achieved success and also give the people who have succeeded they there's a lot of encouragement that they've done something wrong and there's some way to appreciate their success and i commend the work done by the committee and all the members of high flyers that they go out of the way they spend great deal of time to organize these events you know they're not easy they like in uh, having a wedding without the bride and the bridegroom the all the arrangements are the same so, the, so therefore i respect you that you do a lot of work even celebrating success is also very important because that is what you encourage other people to emulate uh you know uh, of course receiving it in your own country yeah. and being a global achiever how does it feel it's proud feeling i'm sure you know you see, representing i am very fortunate because i had so many advantages but what is number one i had a remarkable mother she was a teacher uh, i was forced to miss child my father was assassinated because he opposed the break of india so we had a very humble beginning but the mother gave me the right value the values are what makes people if you have a good value you're a good person if you have a bad value you're a bad person so i'm very grateful to my late mother who was really very strict he said if you earn money for what if you don't have respect money has no value so you earn money to have respect so if you lose respect in the process of it then you have lost everything so that's the one thing i remark in life when i got married she supported me fully if i had to watch my back i could work better she was looking after the family she went out to work and uh, i didn't have to worry because she's such a capable young lady uh, and she gave me full support brought extra income through that income we send our children to private school to buy a better house so women empowerment is a prerequisite for a civil and a progressive society and then when i started my business i had remarkable staff they believed in me and they believed in my vision they gave me 110% because we said look we can't be mediocre we have to be the best among the rest by being mediocre nobody going to notice us so we have to strive to be excellent and uh, for that we were rewarded by her majesty the queen on record five times and the prime minister came to give us the queen's award that how this guy have achieved a remarkable success in such a short period of time it's all about uh, commitment uh, a vision and ethics so therefore i was very lucky that i came from india a secular and democratic country we are taught to use merit 
not race or religion. So therefore, we could integrate wherever we go very easily and quickly. And today, you can see most of the blue chip companies are run by India because of the constitution was given to us by our leaders. They could have easily given us a, a constitution where religion based, and they could have put us in a religious state jacket. We could not move right, left, or centre. But now we are free. We enjoyed freedom right from the day one. Indian democracy is the most stable and most durable democracy, and it is a beacon of hope for the developing country. That people, so diverse population in India, so many religions, so many races, so many languages, so many cultures, so many food, living side by side, not for 10 days or 20 days or 10 years or seven, for hundreds, thousands of years. We are a cradle of civilization and we can be rightly proud of our values because we are now shaping the modern world by exporting doctors, engineers, scientists, teachers, businessmen. Now the Prime Minister of the United Kingdom is Indian. So we are really making a positive uh, difference because of the value we inherited from our leader like Mahatma Gandhi. I mean, Mahatma Gandhi was not an Indian icon, he was a global icon. He changed the world as we see it. The civil rights movement in America was inspired. Martin Luther was inspired by Dr. Martin Luther, was inspired by Gandhi Ji. Apartheid regime in South Africa was inspired by Gandhi Ji. You know, the uh, end of party came. So Gandhi Ji set the you know a, a, a non-violence movement, which more and more people appreciate that if you have a strength in a cause, you don't need to use violence. So today, India got uh, independence through non-violence uh, method, and that is the biggest achievement of this great country. Thank you so much. Thank you for having me. Thank, Thank you. you. God bless you. <coughs> so here. Yeah. 
So can you just tell me on the same? Yes. Anu is white, huh? Yeah, look at this camera. Look at that white. Okay. Right, so we just have you a picture, huh? please come together. Yes. Yeah. How much I give you a solo picture? Like? Yes. Thank you. This is the third edition uh, of Global Achievers and, and it makes country proud, you know, when you have achievers from all over the world. What do you have to say? Uh, well, it's a privilege to host something as, uh, you know, fine and as uh, uh, a show which has so much in depth. And uh, uh, this is the third edition and I've been doing it. Uh, this is the second time that I'm uh, hosting this event for uh, Ravi Kumar. And congratulations to all the winners, uh, all the people who have been nominated and who are to achieve the award today, the High Flyer 50 Global Achievers Award. And uh, uh, it's an honor for me to be on the same uh, platform as these amazing achievers. And uh, maybe uh, next year I should be getting one of, the, one of these awards. Absolutely. What are your thoughts of you being part of it for two years, you know, when you have achievers from all over the world and they come to their own country and, you know, meet people, culture, culture exchange. In, in the in the real time, uh, um, um, uh, definitely you know most of the people. Uh, I think the whole fact that when you leave your country and you go and stay abroad and you are able to achieve a lot more, and I suppose that whole feeling of uh, the, the feeling of being proud and you have so much of uh, um, uh, uh, you know uh, you feel that you've achieved so much in life. And eventually you come back, it's more like a homecoming for you. you. You come back here and you see people, uh, they look up to you. You know, there's, there's lionization. There's this feeling of uh, having attained something in life. So I think it's, it's, it's absolutely incredible feeling. And uh, again, like I said, you know, I'm looking forward to meeting most of these achievers who've come from, uh, from abroad. Apne desh mein cheez karna hai baat hai. But eventually going out and coming back with a lot of laurels on your shoulders, what more do you want to Thank you so much. Of High Flyers 50 Global Achievers Awards, what would you like to say? What a sammanit message is that if you are a man, you will be able to do it. You will be able to do it.
वो ना सबका ना एक मिनट सबका ना एवॉर्डीज का बाइट लेना बाद में सबका बाहर ठीक है ना खत्म होने के बाद अंदर भी ले सकते हो कहीं भी ले सकते हो लेकिन यहाँ पे अच्छा रहेगा बेड ऑफ वगैरह है ना तो वो बहुत इम्पोर्टेंट है ठीक है सो आकाश ठीक है आकाश वो इम्पोर्टेंट है संजीव वगैरह हैं कोविड के बाद एक्चुअली मैं बोलूँगा कि कोविड खत्म होने के बाद हमारा ये थर्ड एडिशन है हमने कोविड के बाद शुरू किया था उसमें पचास लोगों को हमने चुना था अलग अलग फील्ड्स के लोग थे जिन्होंने काफ़ी अचीवमेंट्स लिए थे अपनी अपनी फील्ड में और उसके बाद सेकेंड एडिशन हुआ उसमें भी ग्लोबल इंडियंस के को हमने टारगेट किया था और ग्लोबल इंडियंस जो जिन्होंने काफ़ी अपनी 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 फील्ड में सक्सेस लिए उन लोगों को फीचर किया था और उनको अवार्ड्स दिए थे सो भी थर्ड एडिशन है और ये एडिशन हम हमारा जो ये एडिशन का टाइटल है वो ग्लोबल अचीवर ग्लोबल अचीवर्स में हम नॉट ओनली इंडियन हम ग्लोबल पीपल को इंक्लूड कर रहे हैं मतलब दे कैन बी अदर नेशनल्स ऑल्सो दोज हु आर फ्राम यू नो कैन बी फ्राम एनी कंट्री वर्ल्ड वाइड फ्राम किसी भी कंट्री से दुनिया की वो हो सकते हैं जैसे हमारे इस एडिशन में कुछ जो अचीवर्स हैं वो दूसरी कंट्री से हैं दूसरे कंट्री के नेशनल हैं वो यू एस ए के हैं यू के के हैं सो इस तरह का ये हमारा एफर्ट है और टू मेकिंग इट मोर इंटरनेशनल सो वी आर ट्राइंग वेरी हार्ड सो मे बी इन द फ्यूचर सो वी विल बी कमिंग आउट विद इंटरनेशनल एडिशंस विद द पीपल हैविंग इंटरनेशनल रिकग्निशन ओके सॉरी सॉरी कैटेगरी तो मतलब जो मेजर जो कैटेगरीज हैं हमने वो बनाई तो इस इस एडिशन में हमारी एक कैटेगरी है प्राइड ऑफ इंडिया अवार्ड्स जिसमें हमने पांच कैटेगरी बनाई थी बिजनेस एंटरटेनमेंट स्पोर्ट्स ब्यूरोसी एंड पॉलिटिक्स सो उसमें हमने एंटरटेनमेंट इन द फील्ड ऑफ एंटरटेनमेंट वी हैव चूजन मिस्टर अरुण गोविल और स्पोर्ट्स में कोमलिका बारी जो आर्चरी प्लेयर है वो वर्ल्ड टाइटल होल्डर है और पॉलिटिक्स में हमने कंवरजीत सिंह बख्शी जो जो न्यूजीलैंड से हैं फॉर्मर पार्लियामेंट्रियन और ब्यूरोसी में राजेंद्र भरूड डॉक्टर राजेंद्र भरूड वेरी फेमस पर्सनैलिटी फ्राम महाराष्ट्र एंड so these uh, so we are choosing people from different categories so that's it thank you aapne kaha ki third edition hai so aapka agla edition kitne jaldi dekh sakte next year next year thank you sir thank you thank you What do you want me to speak about? आप बताइए You want me to look here या इधर ठीक थैंक यू आई थिंक बहुत ही बहुत ही इम्पॉर्टेंट और बहुत ही बढ़िया इनिशिएटिव है हम लोग देखते हैं कि आ, हमारे देशवासी आ, अलग अलग देशों में जाके बहुत अच्छा काम करते हैं तो ये एक ऐसा इनिशिएटिव है जिसमें आप आ, बाहर जो रह रहे हैं हमारे इंडियंस अब्रॉड 
उनको जब हम लोग आइडेंटिफाई कर रहे हैं और जब उनको हम लोग फैसिलिटेट कर रहे हैं तो उनको ना ही उनको ये भी पता चलता है कि हम लोग भी बहुत प्राउड हैं कि हमारे इंडियंस बाहर जाके जो जो काम कर रहे हैं जो जो अच्छी अच्छी चीज़ें कर रहे हैं बाहर के देशवासियों के लिए हमारे देशवासियों के लिए और हमारा नाम ऊँचा कर रहे हैं तो उस उन लोगों को ये रिकग्नाइज़ करने का जो इनिशियटिव है ये बहुत ही बढ़िया इनिशिएटिव है और ऐसे बहुत ही कम देखे हैं मैंने इनिशिएटिव तो आई थिंक डिफरेंट है एंड इट्स अ वेरी गुड वन आई विश दैम ऑल द बेस्ट वेल आई थिंक आई थिंक फिर से करें बहुत ही इंटरेस्टिंग जर्नी रही है बहुत अप्स एंड डाउन रहे हैं जो सक्सेसेस हैं उनके बारे में सब लोग जानते हैं जिनकी वजह से ऑब्वियसली ये अवार्ड मिला है बट काफ़ी सारी अटैम्प्ट ऐसे भी रहते हैं जो कि अनसक्सेसफुल रहते हैं उस उतने सक्सेसफुल नहीं हो पाते जितना आप चाहते हैं बट उनसे आप सीखते हैं यू लर्न फ्रॉम दैम एंड यू मूव फॉरवर्ड एंड आई थिंक दोज थिंग्स और दोज अटैम्प्ट दैट पीपल कॉल फेलियर उनको मैं लर्निंग अपॉर्चुनिटीज़ कहता हूँ एंड उन लर्निंग्स की वजह से आगे की जो हमारे अटैम्प्ट होते हैं वो सक्सेसफुल होते हैं सो आई आई थिंक ऑल क्रेडिट टू द सो कॉल्ड फेलियर्स दैट आई हैड इन लाइफ विच हैव हेल्प मी बिकम सक्सेसफुल थैंक यू एक और ले लूँगा